It's been an exceptional year for New Motors 2011. There's been a four-wheel drive Ferrari, a cracking new Mini Coupe. There's also been a funky new little city car from Volkswagen called the Up. But when it's come to picking the car of the year, it's been a no-brainer. The Range Rover Evoque is a car that is very special indeed. And I'm delighted to say that it's been an even bigger sales success than even I thought, and even Land Rover for that matter. This car has taken off like wildfire. The Evoque didn't even go on sale until September, but Land Rover have taken a staggering 40,000 orders for this machine. It's also been a great story for British jobs, because 1,500 new workers have been employed at Land Rover's Halewood plant building this car. When Land Rover told me that the Evoque drove like a coupe on road, I didn't really believe them, to be honest. It's like driving a cross between a Mini Cooper and an Audi TT, just a lot more comfortable. There are a lot of things where the Evoque breaks new ground for Land Rover. It's the first with the option of two-wheel drive. It's also the first Range Rover that will do over 50 to the gallon. And with prices starting at just under 28,000, it's also the cheapest Range Rover ever to come out. But really the Evoque has simply been the icing on the cake for Land Rover in what's been a great year. Sales are up by just over 20% and they're going to finish over 200,000 for the year, which is a phenomenal number. So all that remains to be said is, Merry Christmas Land Rover, you are my worthy car of the year.